Hi, my name is Mary Poffenroth, and I'm an adjunct professor of biology, and today we're going to be talking about ecosystems, as well as the abiotic and biotic factors that go into that ecosystem. So let's start with ecosystems. What is an ecosystem? Well, it's pretty much all of the living organisms, as well as the non-living components like hydrogen, oxygen, carbon, nitrogen, sunlight, water, soil, all of these things interacting within a given geographic area. So let's talk a little bit more about those abiotic and biotic factors. Biotic, bio, meaning life, biotic factors are gonna be all of the living organisms found in that ecosystem. They're going to be things like fungi, animals, plants, and bacteria, all working together to promote the health of that ecosystem. Now, abiotic factors are non-living organisms. They're gonna be things that help to allow life to happen in this ecosystem, but they themselves are not living. These are things, again, like hydrogen, oxygen, carbon, nitrogen, phosphorus, sunlight, water, and soil, just to name a few. It's important to note that the living organisms or the biotic factors of the ecosystem absolutely depend on all of the abiotic factors to exist. However, if the biotic factors happen to disappear one day, all those abiotic factors would go on just fine. This goes to show how fragile life really is. Thanks for watching, and if you wanna learn more about this subject, click on the link below. Or if you wanna learn more biology, feel free to click on any links around me. And please, rate, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Or maybe, if you have ideas for more videos, send us an email at requests at mahalo.com. Thanks for learning.